Hello and welcome to West London and we're talking today about two teams who have fabulous traditions Chelsea and West Ham United Great to be with you from Stamford Bridge I'm Derek Ray, Stuart Robson is alongside me to provide expert analysis Stuart, how do you see this going? Well, the all-important area, Derek, is going to be that midfield If Chelsea can dominate that area and create an overload they're going to control the game That's going to be key to who wins this match Number seven And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukas Fabianski stands between the posts. He said Jock plays with Angelo Ogbonna in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And they kick off here. And he keeps going. And Kai Havertz. And a goal! That is a very bright start. Perfect way to open. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Hammers get the ball moving again. Will there be a quick reply from them? There needs to be. Ryan Fredericks. Antonio. Goalkeeper should take charge. Reese James. Good technique displayed. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Mount. No closed down. Oh, surely! No goal. It won't count. The flag was raised. Well, he did finish it well, but I think everybody knew he was offside there. Check. Rice with it. Lanzini. Antonio. A very effective challenge put in. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Really closing him down. 
Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Kai Havertz. How about the cross? Free kick to Chelsea. Cross towards that far post. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. And taken short. Conte Werner and the keeper stretching to deny him <laughs> who can he pick out survived the attack Lanzini in possession Bowen Chelsea have it back now Marcos Alonso they've regained possession and the attacking options appear plentiful and that is offside Suchek. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. An alert intervention. Can they hit on the break? They need to get bodies back. Conte. Declan Rice, Lanzini, attacking possibilities for West Ham, well nothing comes of it, it looked promising, Lanzini, well, it looked as though they might be in just for a second or two, Havertz read it magnificently and intercepted it's looking promising and a chance to level it great reflex action well that should have been a goal mind you it's a brilliant save Keen to take it short here. Promising possession, this. Antonio. On the ball, Diop. Lanzini. 
magnificent challenge to win it back. N'Golo Conte. James. And he's beaten his man comprehensively. Mount. Must be. Oh, he saved it well. A short corner here. Once again to the middle. Well, that was never likely to trouble the keeper. Lanzini. And a poor ball. Now, what can they do from here? Making sure it didn't get past him. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? Insufficient guile from that corner. Keeper's ball. Declan Rice I'm showing good defensive judgment and Chelsea could be onto something and he's broken free well unfortunately he couldn't keep the shot down Check. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Vladimir Kuval. An important interception. Kai Havertz. Conte now. Fluency of movement. Marcos Alonso. Marcos Alonso. Oh, frustration for those waiting in the middle. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Oh, the penalty's been given. And it's not what they had in mind. It's falling apart for them. And into the book he goes too. Well, once he gave the penalty, he was always going to give him a yellow card. to extend their lead here. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it! <laughs> and he's fired over the corner. It's going to be so difficult to stop them now. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Don't go anywhere. We're going to have five additional minutes. Antonio. Now with Havertz. And space here on the flank. 
Will he finish? And it goes! The lead just gets bigger. Surely they can't let this slip now. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Substitution time it is. Now they get the ball moving once more. It's been all Chelsea so far. You sense there could be extra punishment handed out. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. And indeed a red card it is. Well, they should still win this, but it's a silly dismissal, you have to say. Substitution time it is here. Substitution for Chelsea coming off the pitch, number 19, Mason Mount, to be replaced by number 8, Matteo Kovacic. Suchek. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Werner. Kovacic takes on the shots. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London. Well, Timo Werner, no two ways about it, can strike fear in any opponent, Stuart. Yeah, he's been brilliant, hasn't he? He looks such a threat every time he gets the ball. And, of course, he scored a very good goal. Well, he keeps going. So back underway here, and West Ham left with a real mountain to climb in the second half. Can they respond? Suchek. Rice with it. Ben Rama. And fine work from Chelsea to win the ball back. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. A lopsided contest. 4-0. Suchek. Antonio. Antonio. It's with Ryan Fredericks. Declan Rice. Ben Rama. Can they convert? Not out of the woods yet. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. What an incredible save. Mateo Kovacic. Marcos Alonso. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Timo Werner. Here's Kovacic. And smart defending. Well, flinging himself at it.
So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Who can they pick out? Well, he'll be a bit deflated following that effort, but he was being tightly marked. <laughs> Vlasic. Rice. Keeper did his job to begin with. Oh, it's a wild, wild finish. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball. And that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Declan Rice and the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage now what can they do from here Rhys James he has time to play it over and he's done well to tip it over the bar corner kick forthcoming well, the referee took note of the earlier infringement, and a booking it is now. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. And over it comes. Well, a bit short with the clearance. On well, a time for composure on the ball. Suchek. Marcos Alonso. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Sloppy in possession from West Ham. Could be a chance to break here. Can they take advantage of the situation? Well, it was a brilliant break, but no goal as a result. Well, forget the finish and just admire the way they counter-attack there. They did it with such pace and quality. minutes remaining now Vlasic Antonio Suchek oh could it be Antonio and gobbled up with ease by the keeper
Christensen. Rhys James. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Can he put it away? A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And the finish is really good. Low and hard beyond the goalkeeper. It's a lovely goal all round. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. 15 minutes left for play. Suchek. Antonio. Fredericks now. On the ball, Mikael Antonio. Ben Rama. Now Alex Kral. Marcos Alonso. Rudiger has it. Mateo Kovacic. Conte has it. Tremendous intuition to win it back. N'Golo Conte. James. Hudson-Odoi Romelu Lukaku now Well, he likes to run at them Fine goalkeeping to push that away The referee has given a corner So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture Well, they fancy a short one. Oh, fancy footwork. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. For Niles. Now Alex Kral. Ben Rama. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. Favouring the short one. And there it is! A goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Ben Rama read it magnificently and intercepted. Thiago Silva. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. And take it away.
Lukaku. Hudson Odoi. Here's Kovacic. Marcos Alonso. And it's a quality pass. Well, it might still work out for them. This looks more than decent. Chance to play it in. And breaking at pace with Menace. Nicely timed tackle. Marcos Alonso. Mateo Kovacic. And that is going to be that. The referee blows the whistle and it brings this game to an end. Disappointment, you've got to say, for West Ham. Oh, oh dear, Derek. That was a worrying display. They were completely outplayed in almost every department. The coach has got a lot of work to do before the next game. Well, he is a player with the capacity to...